a lot of people think that the faster air travels, the more pressure it exerts. Now, this is true if air was traveling along a tube and as it exits, it hits you. However, for the air that's traveling inside the tube, it actually exerts a lower pressure. This can be explained with Bernoulli's principle, which states that for a flowing fluid, an increase in its speed causes a decrease in its pressure. And this is true for liquids and gases, which are fluids. If you're wondering why and how, you can visualize it this way. Imagine there's a bunch of kids strolling along a hallway. Now, if they're not monitored, they're going to try to get their hands on every conceivable surface. They'll try to touch the walls, they'll touch paintings, switches, furniture. They'll try to get their hands on every surface that's within their reach. Now, imagine the same bunch of kids in that same hallway, but this time they're running as fast as they can from end to end they will not have the same opportunity or time to touch the same surfaces. And that's exactly true for fluids as well. Now, pressure of fluids is caused by the collision of the fluid particles against the walls of the container that's holding them. So, if a fluid, for example air, was traveling very quickly through a tube, it will not have the same opportunity or time to collide against the walls of the container as compared to if it were traveling at a lower speed. And that's what Bernoulli's principle is about. For flowing fluid, the greater its speed, the lower its pressure. And this also explains how spray bottles work. Now when we press on this lever, we will push the air out at high speed creating a region of low pressure, especially above the vertical tube. Now the higher air pressure that's inside the bottle, which is equivalent to atmospheric pressure, will press on the surface of the liquid, forcing it to go up the tube, just like a straw, towards the region of low air pressure. The liquid will exit the nozzle together with the air to create a fine spray of liquid. Bernoulli's principle explains how many devices work and also explains how airplanes are able to take off.